Hello guys, welcome to Online Web Tutor. I am Sanjay. Now from this video session guys, we are going to start a new exciting playlist something called WooCommerce Theme Development Tutorial. This is our very first part. Now inside this video, we are going to discuss about some basic introduction. Now what we are going to study inside this course? Inside this course, we are going to make a WordPress theme which supports WooCommerce features. Now first of all, you might wondering that is, what is WooCommerce? Let's say that right now, you don't have any idea about WooCommerce. So what basically it is? So WooCommerce means a website as well as including a online store. We already pretty know about website as well as a online store. We are going to include these two features into a single website. It means we have a website. Inside that website, we have a home page. We have about us page, let's say services as well as our contact us page. Now along going through a simple website, we are going to make an online store. Online store is a store from which we are going to sell our products. It means from admin panel, we are going to create some products on the basis of some categories and we are going to sell from our website. So including these two features, this is known as a WooCommerce. So inside WordPress, we will have a WooCommerce plugin. By the help of that WooCommerce plugin, we are going to make a custom theme development. It means from the next video, what we will do, first of all, we are going to make a plan of this course. After that, we will install the latest version of WordPress. After that, after installing our latest version of WordPress, we are going to install step by step our WooCommerce theme development tutorial. Inside WordPress, we have a section called theme development, but this is WooCommerce theme development which is much different from our only a simple theme development. It is because inside this time we are going to create a custom theme as well as we are going to maintain our online store as well. So if I back to browser, now this is the topic what we are going to search and we are going to study something called WooCommerce theme development. Now from the next video, we are going to install first of all all about the latest version of WordPress. So this is the official website. If we click on get WordPress, after clicking on that, now as we can see that the current latest version is as we have called 5.4.1. Now by the help of this WordPress setup, our theme development concept as well as while using our WooCommerce plugin and its customizing features, we are going to make a WooCommerce theme. As we have already discussed that WooCommerce means that it is going to contain a simple website as well as a online store. While going through this course, as we know that we have a standard format of theme development in WordPress, we have many more functions that actually we need to memorize something let's say that the template concept about single page about archive page as well as using some functions called get header get footer as well as about the whole importance of functions.php while going through not about uh, all about our file hierarchy means template hierarchy not about WordPress functions, we also know about WordPress hooks as well as about filters hooks. So we are going to use inside this course all about our action hooks as well as filter hooks and we will customize inside WooCommerce plugin. So we are going to work over the global things like our WordPress functions about template hierarchy of WordPress as well as template hierarchy of WooCommerce plugin as well as we are going to customize all the things and bind with action hooks as well as with our filter hooks. 
So while going through all these concepts, we are going to start about WooCommerce theme development from the next video. This is only for the overview that is, we are going to make a theme which is going to support a simple website. It means we are going to create some menus from our WordPress something home, about us, contact us and then we will install a WooCommerce plugin which creates some default pages like account page, checkout page, cart page and shop page. Also it will add some menus inside our admin panel. So while going through those things, we are going to make a completely beginner's WooCommerce theme development tutorial. So this is the first video of this course. So I think guys that this is the video or this is the course is going to be much exciting course inside our YouTube channel. So for this video session guys, thank you for watching and have a great day.